Well, this next story is coming to us from China Daily, and it is talking about how microblogs seem to have gained a lot of power here in the country. The report goes on to say that with social media becoming more common in the country, microblogs have become the greatest source of scandals that damage companies' reputations. Now, this is coming to us from a report that was released earlier on Thursday. The report went on to say that microblogs have also helped ensure that news of scandal spreads faster and with greater reach. According to Debbie Chong, who is the president of Ogilvy and Mather Group in Shanghai this past Thursday, the far-reaching popularity of microblogs will have serious consequences for companies and brands operating in China. She went on to say that microblogs have become one of the most common means of provoking scandals and furthering the spread of information. Al Givi and Mather is an international advertising agency, and along with CIC, which is a provider of business intelligence here in China, both companies work together to publish the white paper "Crisis Management in the Microblog Era." Their work used information that was taken from microblogs on Tencent Weibo and Sina Weibo, as well as from reports from the search engine Baidu and other media reviews, in order to identify and analyze the biggest online scandals of 2011. The report went on to say that the pervasive use of microblogs has led to scandals arising with increasing frequency and speed. The report goes on to say that statistics from the China Internet Network Information Center shows that there were more than 250 million. Microbloggers in China as of December of 2011, a 297 percent increase from 2010. The report also says that many multinational companies have also taken to use microblogs here in China. Isabel Liu, who is the vice president of ABB North Asia in China, has said that we hope to reach all of our stakeholders through Weibo, and we also want to hear their comments and suggestions. So it appears as though if you want to make a statement in China, the first、uh, step would. Be to open up a microblog.